My name is Peter Savoni. I'm the owner of CNC T-shirts. My business specializes in multiple things, embroidering, silk screening, uh, we do specialty items also. We do also sports apparel. We do packages for different volleyball teams, softball and baseball. Um, we do backpacks, we do baseball bags, the whole nine yards. So we embroider all that stuff. We also sublimate. We do all kinds of cool stuff for teams out there. I do have a team. I have one manager that takes care of it, still screening and printing and doing the artwork. And I have another person that helps digitize and manage. I do run the machines myself. I also still screen. Um, when I got in the business, I started from ground zero. So if you're gonna get in the business, I figure you gotta know everything in case someone calls out sick. It all started when my dad used to work for Burger King, came back from a trip and took two t-shirts and threw them on the table and says, we're gonna open up a t-shirt shop. So then my mom and dad opened a company and then ever since then, we took off. We started with still screening and then we got customers started asking for more embroidery. And then we, we just decided then to get, eventually get our own machines and that's how we got started and we took off from there. The reason why I got into embroidering and kept going with embroidering is because I've seen how lucrative it is and also how it's a very unique process. Having machines and you creating a logo and putting on a shirt and seeing someone wear it is the coolest thing ever. Also, we, you make money. I'm not, gonna, this, I'm not gonna do it just for not money. My first Recoma machine, MT-1502, I picked up back in December of 2019. It ran really smooth. So when I got it in, I did my first run with it. It was super fast, super quiet. It wasn't near as loud. I saw the quality of it. The support system is phenomenal. Tons of videos, tons of tech support. And I'm telling you right now, tech support is very important. If you gotta get a tech support and they don't wanna come out or they tell you they're two weeks out, it's, it's deadly to your business. It has to have that support, otherwise you will not get stuff done. Once I started getting contracts and started picking up some business and I noticed that uh, the sports appeal was getting a little bit crazier and I was doing more backpacks and I had to get stuff done faster, I knew that, that, that I had to move up to the next level. The reason why I purchased the two eight head machines is because I had a contract 20,000 towels and I had to get done rapidly. I noticed that the machines were super fast and I was impressed with that very much. The time frame on getting one run done and then getting the next run up is very important. So the faster you run, the faster you run the job, the faster you hoop, the faster you get on, the more money you're gonna make. I was gonna go with six head, but eight head I thought was a more efficient machine. Also, power wise, you're not doing three phase, you're at regular 110, you just plug it in the wall and go. So there's a lot of good things about the eight head that I liked a lot. Once I realized that um, I could do Richardson hats on them, I fell in love with the machine pretty quick. That uh, was one of the reasons. I saw Will do a demonstration and I was like, I gotta have that machine. A couple of features that I love about the machine, the speed, the easy access to individually taking off the heads. I'm not doing one giant piece putting it on there for hats. The other thing I also like is the the maintenance on it is simple to oil up. It's easy spots, easy to get to. It's not as wide uh, with the tables on them. It's not um, take up so much space. And you can see behind me you know, how narrow they are. The reason why I recommend Rakoma machines for new businesses is because the support system is phenomenal. Tech support is the number one reason why I'm with Rakoma. I wanna make sure that I have tech support so if anything does or I run into a hiccup, I got someone there to snap of a finger and that is really, really important to me. It was a no-brainer.